morning, Sylvia. Yeah, that's right. Once the clouds cleared, it made way for such a nice afternoon. Here's a look at our KCAL 9 weather network right now. Real time data is streaming in. Van Nuys currently 65 degrees. City of Industry 64 and low 60s also for Long Beach. Mid 60s currently for Placentia. For the rest of the Southland, temperatures in downtown LA currently at 61 degrees. Just know we are expecting more clouds to build in. Increase tonight by tomorrow. We're going to wake up once again to gray skies and then we will see clearing by the afternoon. Temperatures in the high 60s. I'll have a look at your five day outlook coming up. Back to you. All right, sure did. Hi, Lena. Hi, Sylvia. Take a look. This is a live look at Long Beach. Earlier, they were socked in with clouds. They were looking at gray skies, and then it started to clear up late this afternoon. They're looking at some nice sunshine right now, but we will see more clouds building in. Here's a look at what it feels like outside in downtown LA. It's about 64 degrees, Burbank, mid 60s, Riverside about 70, high 60s for Lancaster, and 64 for Oxnard. We are expecting mostly sunny conditions tomorrow as well, with temperatures expected to be either at normal or just slightly below. Now we will see more clouds tonight because of the cloud cover today. It really didn't allow temperatures to get as warm as what we thought. So temperature wise, we we're running much cooler than normal at 61 degrees. Average high usually in the high 60s. You could see we weren't that much uh, warmer than what we felt overnight at the low about 50 degrees. Sunset today 445. There is a system just to the north of us. This has provided a lot of moisture for Northern California, about an inch and a half of rain. We're not going to see any of that moisture here in Southern California, but we we will see more of the cold air invading the region and we're going to see more of the clouds building in. Once the system moves off to the east, we will see a ridge of high pressure starting on Sunday. That means much warmer conditions for the beginning of next week. We could even see high fire danger. That's something we will continue to monitor. Tonight, increased cloud cover, dropping temperatures down to the mid 50s. We will see light winds too. By tomorrow, we're hoping that we will see temperatures right where we should be this time of year in the high 60s with partly cloudy skies. But it, again, it all depends on how much marine layer moves in tonight and how much of it can clear uh, fast by the time we head into the afternoon. High 60s also for the valleys, mid 60s down to Laguna Beach and Long Beach, high 60s for the LA Basin and low 70s for Riverside County, also for areas like Rancho Cucamonga. In the next five days, we will see temperatures right where we should be for the next few days, and then we will see temperatures really start to warm up as we head into Monday because of that high pressure system. For the valleys and the Inland Empire, one more day of 70 degree weather, then temperatures drop as we head down into Friday. And for the beaches, just know you will wake up to gray skies for the next couple of days. By the weekend, we will see more sunshine peeking through with nice sunny weather expected by Saturday. And for the mountains, because of this cold front moving in, we will see an increase of winds for you today, tomorrow, and Friday. And then you get a break on Saturday, and you will see more breezes pick up by Sunday and Monday. Same thing with the deserts. Breezy conditions expected Thursday and Friday. Lena, Sylvia, back to you. All right, Amber, thank you. Hey there, Lena. Hey there, Sylvia. Here's a look at our current temperatures out the door right now. 61 degrees in downtown LA, 64 for Pasadena. A little cooler if you're living along the coast with temperatures in the low 60s. We are expecting more clouds to build in today. A stronger marine influence will mean overcast conditions as we wake up tomorrow. We're hoping that we will see partly cloudy skies by the afternoon, depending on just how many, much of the clouds roll in tonight. Five day forecast shows temperature wise. We will stay right where we should be this time of year, and then we will see a warming trend take place by Monday. Back to you.